is it possible for two lines running parallel in the exact same direction to eventually converge together and meet? They can if the space they're in is curved. And curving space isn't as mind-warping as you might think. Consider the fact that we live on the sphere of the Earth. To describe a location on the 3D surface, however, we don't use 3D coordinates. We're not going to describe the location of a city as measuring from the center of the Earth a certain distance over in X, up in Y, and forward in Z. Using 3D coordinates to describe locations and paths on the surface of our sphere is just too complicated. Although the surface of the Earth curves in three dimensions, we describe it with the two-dimensional coordinates of latitude and longitude, or north-south and east-west. Confining these perpendicular directions of north-south and east-west to the curving surface of the sphere leads to some interesting results. For instance, if you trace a path running perfectly east, it will loop around the Earth and meet back up with itself. The east-west parameter is continuous with no limits to it. However, if you travel in a path due north, there is a limit to how far you can go in that direction. At the North Pole, although there's no physical barrier, it's impossible to keep traveling north, since any distance you move would start taking you south. All of the north-south lines of longitude are finite, with a consistent length. The east-west latitude lines are continuous, but have differing bounded lengths. Consider two paths running due east. If the paths start a certain distance apart and continue east, they will remain that same distance apart. Lines running east-west will always remain parallel. But if you trace two paths that start at the equator a certain distance apart and travel precisely due north, you'll see a different result. The further north they move, the closer together they become, until they converge together at the North Pole. Keep in mind, both paths have not veered from the same direction they both started out in. Although they both move straight, the space they're in is curved. If you force them to remain a fixed distance apart, then they would have to diverge from a pure north-facing path and start splaying out east and west. A curved space such as a sphere, in which parallel lines are able to meet, is considered to have a positive curvature. But we could also have space with a negative curvature that would cause parallel lines to splay further and further apart. Take, for instance, a hyperbolic surface. If the Earth's surface were hyperbolic, the north and south poles wouldn't be single points, but would be rings that spread out wider than the equator. Now, two north-traveling paths would get further and further apart. And, since there's no convergence at the poles, the space could conceivably continue on forever. So, do parallel lines ever meet or grow apart? It depends on your space, and whether and how it could be curved.